All right, well, it is back. God knows for how long. I don't even know what was missed, but it was just like a lot of fighting. And then like we got four people in an elevator shooting us. Um, and then, let me think. Oh, Kaiden was like, we'll take the other one out, Commander. So that's where we are. <laughs> That's the gun. We need to clear those gaps and get the charges set. Got him. The charges are set and ready. Everybody get low and keep your heads down. Oh. Why is nothing being said? We're all set here. Commander, do you read me? The nuke is almost ready, Lieutenant. Get to the rendezvous point. Negative, Commander. The Geth have us pinned down on the AA tower. We've taken heavy casualties. Captain Kira, he's dead. Oh, is this? We'll never make the rendezvous point in time. Get them out of there, Joker. Now. Negative. It's too hot. You can't risk it. We'll hold them off as long as we... It's okay, Commander. I need a couple of minutes to finish arming the nuke. Go get them and meet me back here. I'll bring your ass. It's okay. Rex will have another time. No, where am I going? Can they, they, they didn't, they couldn't give me like a direction? Um, so I guess I'll put it the other way. Reinforcements. We better hurry. Chief, we just spotted a troop ship inbound to your location. It's already here, and it's bleeding gap all over the bomb site.
Can you hold them off? There's too many! I don't think we can hold them! I'm activating the nuke! What are you doing, Chief? Making sure this bomb goes off, no matter what! Okay, we're all gonna die, hello? It's done, Commander. Go get the Lieutenant and get the hell out of here! Belayda, we can handle ourselves. Go back and get Williams! Well, that's another toy. They wanted to really make sure I choose. Uh, I mean, I feel like if I don't save Ashley, we're not gonna get content, so I have to go save Ashley. Williams, radio Joker and tell him to meet us at the bomb site. Yes, Commander, I. It's the right choice, and you know it, Ash. Stay alive. I'll be coming to get you too, Caden. I think we both know that's not gonna happen, Commander. Damn. <laughs> Damn. I'm holding hands with gears. <laughs> out here with his special effects. from the beacons, Shepard. You of all people should understand what the Reapers are capable of. They cannot be stopped. Do not allow <coughs> yourself in pointless revolt. Do not sacrifice everything for the sake of petty freedoms. The Protheans tried to fight, and they were utterly destroyed. Trillions dead. But what if they had bowed before the invaders? Would the Protheans still exist? A submission not preferable to extinction. Do you really believe the Reapers will let us live? Now you see why I never came forward with this to the Council. We organics are driven by a logic. We will fight even when we know we cannot win. But if we work with the Reapers, if we make ourselves useful, think how many lives can be spared. Oh. Once I understood crazy, this, crazy. I joined Sovereign. Though I was aware of the dangers, I had hoped this facility could protect me. You're afraid Sovereign is influencing you. You're afraid he's controlling your thoughts. I've studied the effects of indoctrination. The more control Sovereign exerts, the less capable the subject becomes. That is my saving grace. Sovereign needs me to find the conduit. My mind is still my own. For now. But the transformation from ally to servant can be subtle. I will not let it happen to me. Why are the Geth following Sovereign? 
They believe Sovereign to be some kind of god, the pinnacle of their own evolution. But the reaction of their deity is most telling. It is insulted. Sovereign does not desire the pitiful devotions that gather her at it. They are just tools, and no amount of belief on their part will change that. But as tools, they are useful. They will survive the coming invasion. If organic life is to survive, we must also prove we are useful. We must work with the Reapers. Tell me why Sovereign needs the Conduit. Tell me what it is. Maybe we can find a way to stop it. The Conduit is the key to your destruction and my salvation. Sovereign needs my help to find it. That is the only reason I have not been indoctrinated. Sovereign's manipulating you and you don't even know it. You're already under its power. No, Sovereign needs me. If I find the conduit, I've been promised a reprieve from the inevitable. This is my only hope. I can... What? Why are the Geth following Sovereign? Wait, I already did that. But as tools... Together we can stop Sovereign. We don't have to submit to the Reapers. We can beat them. Well, there's no, yeah, I was gonna say, there's no long, he's, there's no way he's gonna go for it, but I guess cannot be denied. I can even have the choice. The are too powerful. The only hope of survival is to join with them. Sovereign I wonder what it's like to kiss those lips. Like they like flap it out. Maybe they're power, soft. I become a resource worth maintaining. There is no other logical conclusion. You were a specter. You were sworn to defend the galaxy. Then you broke that vow to save yourself. I'm not doing this for myself. Don't you see? Sovereign will succeed. It is inevitable. My way is the only way any of us will survive. I'm forging an alliance between us and the Reapers, between organics and machines. And in doing you know so, I will save more lives than have ever. At least he he thinks he's. But you will not do my. You that Reaper is just evil. That Reaper is like fucking evil. To complete annihilation. And for that, you must die. Dare he trigger a cutscene? Yo, this kind of looks bad. <laughs> it's the movements. I mean, it looks HD, but yeah, the movements are still there. Oh, bye. Come on, this girl. We're going home. All right, everybody, hang on. Oh my God. Yeah, my man is so angry. Okay. <laughs> I can't believe Caden didn't make it. How could we just leave him down there? Alenko knew the risks going in. He gave his life to save the rest of us. Oh my god, it's a song. It should have been me, Commander. You know that. I never leave you. <laughs> oh. Uh, I don't want to flirt her because I feel like I never leave you is very like, why me? Thanks, let's go. I'm sorry, Ash. I'd never leave you behind. I couldn't. What? You know that. 
I should not have picked that. I know, and I'm grateful. But Caden died because of me, because of us. Elenko's dead. We can't change that. But if we don't stop Saren, his sacrifice was made in vain. Yes, sir. I'm. We'll get it done. Commander, excuse me for interrupting, but I have an idea. <laughs> Were they just watching us the talk about it? Saren's <laughs> base was similar to the one you found on Eden Prime. Embrace eternity. Yeah, it's as confusing as it was the first time. Oh, this is what that this is what they line up. What is that shit called? The the Incredible. the covenants. I, I never the, thought the images would be so intense. I need a moment to collect myself. Did the vision make any sense to you? It's a distress call. A message sent out across the Prothean Empire. A warning against the Reapers, but the warning came too late. What about the conduit? There were other images, locations, places I recognized from my research. Ilos! The conduit is on Ilos! I've never heard that name before. I am not surprised. Ilos is in a region of space accessible only through the Mew Relay. But the Mew Relay was lost thousands of years ago. Nobody knows where it is. How do you lose a mass relay? Its original coordinates would place it deep inside the Terminus systems. Unfortunately, a star in one of those nearby systems went nova roughly 4,000 years ago. Went nova, that's cool. The shockwave sent the relay trillions of kilometers off course. Then the dust and the radiation from the exploding star engulfed that entire region in a dense nebula cloud. Finding any object in space is difficult. Finding the Mew Relay inside a nebula cloud is virtually impossible. It would take decades. If nobody's ever been there, how did you recognize Ilos from my visions? I recognized some of the landmarks from the photos and vids I'd seen during my research. I know of Ilos. I just do not know where it is. Are you saying it's hopeless? I am afraid so. Unless you somehow find the coordinates for the Mew Relay, then it would be possible to... Oh. <laughs> I am sorry. The joining is... exhausting. I should go to the medical bay. I can and ask down again. For a I feel like this is the Dr. Chakwa should take That me. will not be necessary. I just need some rest. Somewhere quiet. Okay. We're done here. Dismissed. Commander, there's a combo nearby. I can link us in if you want to report back to the Citadel Council. You know, to warn him about Sovereign. Set the link up, Joker. They need to know. Patching it through. Commander Shepard. I'm pleased to see your mission on Vermar was a success. Saren is Everyone formidable does. enough without an army of Krogan serving under him. The Krogan would have served Sovereign, a Reaper. Yes, we saw mention of this on your report. Sovereign, a sentient machine, a true artificial intelligence. This news is quite alarming, if it turns out to be accurate. Oh, it's accurate. Sovereign's a Reaper. Saren admitted it. He's playing you, Shepard. It's on the Citadel. You probably saw your earlier reports. The ones talking about your vision and the Reapers. It's highly possible Saren is using false oh. information to throw you off balance. Our own intelligence has never turned up any corroborating information. Oh my God, Sooner or later, you're going to have to take something I say on faith, Counselor. Try to see this from our perspective, Commander. Saren is a threat we can recognize. However, as far as we know... The Reapers only exist in your visions. Our decisions affect trillions of lives. We cannot act on the accusations of a single person, even a specter. Not without solid evidence. The Council cannot take any official action. Why I even call them? That is why we created the Spectres. <laughs> you have Hang the authority up. to act as you see fit. If you truly believe Sovereign is the real threat, you must take whatever steps are necessary to stop it. And Saren. Yeah, I'll save the world. Good luck, Commander. From all of us. Okay. Okay, let me go down to the bay and sell everything. 
It's really quiet. <laughs> I feel like there typically is music, right? Oh, <gasps> Kaiden's not gonna be there anymore. Damn. Damn, that's that's when you know it's sad. When you go to where they normally stand and they're not standing there anymore. to end it here or after I probably catch up with everyone. Yes, Commander? Is there something you need? I should go. Goodbye, Commander. Commander, are you coming to check up on me? You look much better. How are you feeling? Dr. Chakwas assures me I am going to be fine. I was impressed with her knowledge of Asari physiology. You're in good hands. Doctor. I've been thinking about Saren. I actually feel a little sorry for him now. Mm. Sure. He's become a slave to the Reapers and he can't even see it. He is trapped inside his own mind. Part of him senses his identity slowly being swallowed up by Sovereign. But he is powerless to stop it. I wonder how he first fell into Sovereign's trap. Did he think he could somehow stop the Reapers from returning? Or was he simply driven by a lust for power and glory? Whatever Saren's reasons may have been, they're long gone now. He has to be stopped. Yes, I suppose you're right. He may be Sovereign's victim, but he is also a threat to all life as we know it. Uh, let's not spend every free minute talking about Saren. It is bad enough we are chasing him across the galaxy. I like talking with you, Liara. Oh, no matter God. what the subject. I mean, friends. Then let us talk. Are you okay? Right, guys, friends? I have nightmares. I'm not sleeping well. <laughs> the visions keep me up at night. I wish there was something I could do to help you. <sighs> you need to be at your best, Commander. The crew relies on you for leadership. It can be a heavy burden. I can handle the responsibility of command. But if I don't stop Saren, the entire galaxy gets wiped out. I'm sorry, Commander. The last thing you need is someone constantly reminding you of how grim things are. Is there anything else you would rather talk about? No, bye. I should go. Goodbye, Commander. <laughs> Let me sell some things. Looking for supplies? Let's see what you've got. You bet, Commander. Oh my god, I'm s I have so much f d credit. <laughs> okay, I, you're right. I think I have to do equipment first before I do any of that. Oh, let me go to their lockers. Let me give Tali the best things. Then, I guess, Garrus and Ashley. Oh, they are a fuck. I'll take that first. Maybe the other guy can use it. Is it? Maybe Carrie's can use it. Two of the same armor. Oh, 
ところは。That's some nice looking armor. You know what? I'll put that on him. Guess she can keep that shit. Okay, then you look at my own equipment. Uh, three, fifteen, seven, and fifty. So this is just better. Period. Three, fifteen. Yeah, I'll just do this, and then I put my upgrades. Perfect. Um, on Schmeter, five. I'll do one of these. Stiletto, six. I mean, I guess what I have is like a stiletto six. Yeah, it's the same. Time to go sell things. Probably gonna sell like 20 things I don't want to, but. Okay. Looking for supplies? Sort by type. There you go. I'm just gonna sell my duplicates. Ones. Okay, I don't need any of those. Shotgun, storm. Upgrades. Okay, so by level. So how do I go how do I go to the very bottom? Oh my god, I have so much money! Look at that! <laughs> Shit. Sold one of the. Who cares? How do I? Right here. Sure. Why not? Shredder rounds. Why not? Incendiary rounds. And then fucking tugs and runs are typically smaller, fired at high speeds. Shield bypass. Oh, why not? Oh shit. I can't add more than. Oh, right here. Uh. 
combat scanner. Damage. <laughs> For sure. And then the third one. For sure, I want that. I guess? I don't even know what the fuck that means. Oh shit, I need to buy some. Looking Do you have for armor supplies? for me, Let's see sir? What you, you bet, Commander. Phoenix. <laughs> trash. 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 More trash. Wait, Striker 3. Trash. Commander, I... What can I do for you? Something bothering you? It's Saren. He's starting to wonder whether we'll ever find him. He's always one step ahead of us, and he's got those damn geth. We're getting close, Garrus. We'll find him. I wish I had your confidence. I just can't stand the thought of him getting away with everything he's done. I know you're doing everything you can, and if anyone can catch him, it's you. But if there's anything else I can do to help, Anything. Just tell me what you want me to do, and I'll do it. I understand your concern, but we'll find it. Just make sure you're ready to go when we do. Yes, sir. I'll be ready. Okay, next time when we come back? Can I ask you something, Oh, Commander? he's on the... Oh, yeah. What is it? Are you worried that the Council might be protecting Saren? I mean, they were really dragging their heels before. What if we find him, bring him back to the Citadel, and they refuse to act? You seem to speak your mind, Garrus. Well, maybe we shouldn't give them the chance, Commander. Oh. In my opinion, Saren's too dangerous to be kept alive. Too much could happen. He could escape, or the Council might let him go. If we find him, when we find him, I say we make sure we stop him permanently. If Saren won't listen to reason, if he forces my hand, I'll kill him in a heartbeat. But only if it's absolutely necessary. But what's the point in keeping him alive? It just gives him an opportunity to escape or convince the council to listen to him. I and mean, what about the Geth? Honestly, they might try to free him. He's so right. <laughs> we know more about Saren's plans than anyone. But what do we really know? If we just kill him, we lose the chance to find out. Yeah, I see your point. Do you really think there's more to know, other than the fact that he's a raving lunatic? Maybe, maybe not. But it's not a chance I'm willing to take. Yes, sir. Hey, Skipper. Figured Skipper? Tactical Skipper? Okay, I'm just weather. kidding. I'm sorry. Kind of an ill omen. Jesus. You mean on the anniversary of the first contact war? The end of it, yeah. My family always marks it. I'm the only Williams here. I guess you'd be the only other one interested in it. Why me? You can't think I'm the most patriotic person on the ship. Maybe not. Maybe I'd rather share this with you. You ever consider that? Chill, <laughs> Ashley. Ashley. <laughs> it's not my files or something? 
I don't know what you're talking about. I'm General Williams' granddaughter, the commander of the Shinshi yeah, Garrison. Yeah, have we war. not talked about that? What? The only human ever to surrender to an alien race. Okay, I see. You're blacklisted because of your grandfather's cowardice. cowardice. No, did the stream That's stop? That's what the party calls it. I'm not gonna let our name go down. Ashley, stop! Granddad deserves better than that. Oh my god. My stream. <laughs> Okay, it's back. No, it's not. Okay, I'm just gonna wait. I don't know if it's catching up. I think it is, but I'm watching it. <laughs> it's the dumbest thing I've ever done. Oh, you see, it crashed. Oh, it's back now. What the f- Okay, I think it's- I think it's about to catch up. Yeah, I mean, about her being the fucking granddaughter of whatever. I mean, maybe not. I think it's one of those times where it's like... I know it because I've seen the later games, and I assume that's knowledge that we already know. <laughs> the Witcher, season 2 ending. Peace. <laughs> Peace and no spoilers. <laughs> Alright. Okay, it's caught up, so I'm just gonna continue. Hopefully, it gets everything. That's why you dislike aliens. Oh, that's why she's racist. I should have figured this out myself. I don't know how I can help you. Though. Look at who I am, Shepard. Do you ever hear me ask for help? It's not that bad things don't happen to me. If you stay with me long enough, maybe I'll tell you about some of them. But I deal with them myself. I don't need a shoulder to cry on, a knight to rescue me, or a man to make me happy. This is who I am. I like. I, I don't think. You better like her too. I don't think I. I don't so, think I process. So in me, baggage and all. I don't think I. I don't think I understood what she said, but somehow we're flirting. I don't know. I mean, I don't want to say I'm interested in you. I don't want to date you, but I mean, we can still be friends. You're interested in me. It's hard to tell. Maybe I'm not. I guess you've been too busy saving the galaxy. Oh shit. About it. Oh shit. But hey, once we save the galaxy, maybe the Alliance will get its act together. Start acting like an actual government. Commence the saving. Yeah, let's go. We better get going then. Seems I've got something to look forward to. Ew, what? Hello? More than you know. No! I have a feeling things will come to a head soon. But don't worry, Shepard. I'll protect you. No! <laughs> No! <laughs> About Lieutenant Alenko. How are you holding up? Can't say I'm better. Oh Sorry shit, this room looks great right me. now. Just... I hope it stays that way. I don't want any deaths on my hands, and it's my fault. Williams, listen to me. I'm in command of this mission. I made the call, not you. He's dead because of me. It's funny. I don't have any fear of dying for the Alliance, but when I think of someone dying for me, uh, if you don't mind my asking, how did you deal with the losses on Elysium? It was my job to get everyone out safe. I failed. I vowed not to let that happen again. Same here. I'll remember him, and I'll do better for him. Yeah. We need to get a new I haircut. I guess that's all we can do. 
Thanks for the advice, Skipper. Looks like he's trying to hide something. <laughs> hide some secrets under that. What's your opinion on the last mission? We've got a hard fight ahead. Fleets of AI dreadnoughts who've exterminated all life dozens of times over? I think the odds are against us. We have an advantage. We know they're coming and we know about their indoctrination. I don't plan to lie down and die, Skipper. Don't worry about that. Why do you keep calling but me Skipper? Against Reapers? My is that like an, a, a human thing? I won't have a place in this war. That's what pisses me off. Not being able to shoot back. Alright. We'll talk later, Williams. Looking forward to it, Skipper. Why the fuck did you fuck out ever talking to you again? Commander. Things got heated back on Vermeer. You did what you had to do. I respect your choice. I appreciate what you did, Rex. I won't forget it. Just make sure it was worth it. Saren has to pay for what he's done. We'll have him soon enough. Then he can answer for his crimes. He'll do more than just answer if I have anything to say about it. What I'm hearing so is long. everyone is just gonna fucking lay it out on Saren. Saren's gonna get his ass beat. You have my gratitude, Commander. Most people would have left our team behind. Still, I find the loss of Captain Kirahi troubling. But I won't blame you. I know you lost one of your own as well. Captain Kirahi will be missed. But many others will live because he gave his life. That is our lot, I suppose. But there may come a day when so many have been sacrificed, it will be impossible to tell who won. Mm. The mission was a success. That will have to be enough. We won't trouble you for long. Our unit will be disbanded as soon as we depart. Good luck, Commander Shepard. It feels like we're getting near the end, doesn't it, Shepard? With Saren, I mean. Oh, Tali, is this you saying that the game is what's it? <laughs> it won't be much longer. One way or another, it'll all be over soon. You'll find the conduit before he does. I know you will. You have to. And after this is all over, when my pilgrimage ends, and I go back to my own people, I'll be proud to say I was a part of it. <laughs> this isn't about you. Why would anyone... I'm sorry, but why would anyone be so mean to someone that you, like, barely know on your crew? Or, like, I'm not barely, but... We couldn't have done this without you, Telly. You've been good to me. A lot of people treat Quarians like second-class citizens. They just want us to go back to our fleet and disappear. Give me a hug, Telly. I'm sorry. Oh, no, like where's my hug, though? I'm just kidding. Like I'm just kidding. That means a lot, and it says something about you. Okay, how about a high five? happens, I just want to say thank you for that. I kind of want to say you earned it. That sounds nice. But I'll say you will. I'm going to miss you when you go back to your own people, Tally. That won't happen for a while yet. I'll be right here anytime you need me. Alright. I should go. See you later. Thanks, Tally. Something I can do for you, Commander. Carry on, Adams. Aye, aye, Commander. Alright. I'm gonna... Oh. I don't know if it selects missions. <coughs> I think just <coughs> COVID. <coughs> I think I just had to look at it. Oh my god. There's so many side missions. Alright, I'll do this one. It's a Herschel system and Kepler Verge, but I'll do it when I come back. Whenever I come back. I definitely need a break though. All right. Let me see if the stream is good. Did it miss anything? All right. To my own people. Thanks for watching. Until next time. Bye!